Hey guys, welcome back. So, I uh, just got in the Smuggler's Bounty Box for May of 2017. So this is going to be the Han Solo box. I'm so excited. Um, this is one, there's, there's the June, no I'm sorry, there's the July and then the September box. And then this box is done. So I'm hoping that this one's good. Now this box is actually kind of small compared to the rest of them. So I'm hoping whatever is inside is, is really good. Like I said, uh, fingers crossed for um, a two-pack or a ride or something really, really cool. Um, anyway, guys, so I've cut the tape here on the bottom. And I'm going to let you guys see what's in it first. Hopefully it's something good. I can't see yet. All right, so let's see what we have. Wow, it looks like there is not a whole lot of anything in this box today. Um, so the first thing that we have... Um, is going to be um, a cap, which um, it's kind of cool. It's a it's a mud trooper hat. It's a Smuggler's Bounty Box exclusive. Um, the only thing I'm sad about is that it is the it's a snapback, um, and I don't know if you guys pay attention to the type of hats that I wear, but I prefer dad hats. I'm just saying, um, but it's still a cool hat. Um, well, I kind of have a big head and a lot of hair, and you guys are going to see my hair for the first time. Uh, but I'm going to take this out and try it on. Ignore the hat hair, guys. I've had a hat on, like, all day. Um, this is still way too small. I told you I had a big head. Uh, so let's try let's try this. That might have been where I just, no, that was where I just took it off. From. Sorry, guys. I don't know how to work snapbacks because I don't like them. All right, let's try it this way. Um, oof. Oh, wow, this fits kind of weird, but... All right, guys, so I'm rocking the Mud Trooper hat, which I think they did the Mud Trooper because the um, the Funko Shop exclusive was a Mud Trooper, which I actually picked up. Uh, I got really lucky. Or, well, my friend John picked it up for me. So we also have a mystery mini, or rather kind of not a mystery. Um, tells me exactly what it is, but this is going to be a Lando Calrissian mystery mini. Um now this Lando kind of looks like the Lando that was a Hot Topic exclusive uh, variant of Lando Calrissian. So that's kind of cool. Um, so we'll go ahead and open this bad boy up just so we can get a better idea of what it is he looks like. So as you guys know, the, um, the little ones are also... His head is really janky, guys. It's all twisted and turned back, but... Uh, here, I'll put my hand up so you guys can actually get a little look at him. But this is uh, Lando Calrissian's Mystery Mini. I have a few Mystery Minis uh, for Star Wars, which are actually like right there if you guys can see him. Uh, so I'll add him to the collection. Uh, let's see what else we have in here. It looks like I have a pen, which is kind of cool. Um, take this out of the packaging. This is the second Star Wars pen. I've only had the box for a little under a year, so I don't have a lot of the other pens. Um, but this is the, sorry about the trains guys, I live right beside the train tracks. Um, so this is the, the pen, which from the back of the boxes, I know that this guy's name is In Fear's Nest, I think, something like that. So that's a, that's a pretty cool little pen. Um, I'll put this one on my pen board along with Chewbacca. Let's see here, there is a pop in here. Oh, I have one more thing aside from the pop, which is, um, it is a keychain. Um, something I've not gotten in a pop box before. Or, well, I've gotten like pop keychains before. Um, I guess this one is from Funko. This looks like some kind of blaster. Um, Maybe from maybe the Mud Trooper or one of the Storm Troopers. I'm not 100%, guys. Um, actually, I'm going to look at the back of the box here and not show you what's in this. Um, yeah, this looks like the, the blaster from the uh, from the Mud Trooper. So that's what that is. Um, not really a big keychain person. So it feels like kind of just like a cheap throwaway uh, that they put in the box so that there would be more than three items in the box. Um, anyway, guys, so the last thing... Um, is the pop and it is a two pack guys and um, so this one I'm actually pretty excited about this is one of the um, the pops that I actually wanted to see in this box um, and that is the uh, two pack 
Chewbacca and Han Solo where they are chained together. Now, um, I'm going to take this one out so that you guys can get a better look at it because there is a really bad glare. Um, man, I'm getting really good at opening boxes. Uh, the secret, guys, is to press the back flat and then slide something like a knife or a pair of scissors under the top. Uh, it just pops up. It's a great way not to crease the boxes and make them look like they've never been opened. Fun packs. Um, anyway, guys, I'm going to slide this out really quickly here. So... All right, guys, let's see if you can see that. Yeah, so there's Chewbacca and Han. They're on a little platform that says Star Wars, and they are, of course, chained together. Um, and these are stuck to the base, so these aren't coming off, which is good. Um, yeah, these are actually really cool. Like I said, um, this is one of the things I was hoping in this. I've, I'm still holding out for like a Millennium Falcon ride. I think that would be like one of the coolest Star Wars pops that they could ever make. Um, I mean, they gave us four different speeder bikes. They could, you know, which I guess those technically aren't rides, those are deluxes. But still, they could give us a, a you know, a really cool Millennium Falcon ride. Am I right, guys? Or, or am I just, you know, talking out my ass? Hopefully you guys agree with me. But anyway, guys, that is the two-pack. All right, so to do a quick little recap of everything in the box, we, of course, have the two-pack Han and Chewie, where they are chained together. Their heads are nice and bobbly on this one. I like that. Um, we have the the mystery, or, well, I don't like to call it a mystery mini. I know exactly what it is, but one of the mystery mini figures, which is Lando, whose head is also supposed to bobble, but um, the, the spring looks really messed up, so I don't think that one's going to bobble. And then, of course, we also have this little uh, Mud Trooper Blaster, which, again, guys, I think is kind of just a cheap little throwaway. And then we have our pin, which I'm not going to lie. I actually prefer getting the pins to the patches because I don't have anything to put the patches on. Um, but, yeah, guys, that is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this quick little unboxing. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, Thanks for watching, guys.